Okay, so bids all clean, filled for the most part. Um, the list I showed you, so I previously, if you, and I'll link the video below, I went through everything we're going over over the summer and yes, you saw some new things with end of the year evaluations and honestly sales. I was just like, nab it now. Um, but there are some things that I want to do. So like this chalk, it isn't in their bins yet because with the learning without tears message, they have like, the chalks are really, really tiny. They're not like a normal size. So I'm actually going to have them break it up. Um, it's not something I really want to do and they will enjoy it. But I also think like it'll help them learn the responsibility of it. Like this is what we're doing. This is why we're doing it. This is why it's going to help us. X, Y, Z. Um, what else? What else? What else? What else? What else? Oh, um, there are also pencil grips that I will link below suggested by our OT for Jude. Um, it's really just like a foam tube. It's actually pretty cool. Um, and they're different sizes and they fit over everything. So when we get his dry erase markers in, um, I'm going to put those over it. Um, I also have some mini pencils coming in for both kids. Um, oh, and so our OT showed us this like pencil grip trick where you take a uh, little pom-pom sorry I don't have one right now here we're gonna use a cotton ball um, and use it so you you keep this like you have to keep the secret while you're writing so he will like hold the pom-pom right here and write with it so I'll put some of those in James has been for that purpose and I want to work on that but also for Jude I started I got just from my Walmart grocery pickup order, I got the assortment. So it's assorted by colors and size. So with Jude, I started doing like make a pattern or what's the biggest one or what color is this? So, and then he really enjoyed that. So I'll probably just throw a few of those in there too. Um, I explained before, I think a big problem this year was that I just, Jude didn't really respond to what I planned for him. He wanted a lot more things his brother had and his learning style is different. So that was a huge learning curve for me. I, fingers crossed, knock on wood, say a couple extra prayers, think I got it, which is why they have a lot of similar things, but my approach to teaching them will vary, right? Um, is there anything else? Sorry, y'all. Uh, oh, the stuff you saw me, take out very little of it would go like in the actual trash like um like those cotton balls and q-tips I'll just put those in our art cart we'll use that for painting and stuff like that like uh you know I the wiki sticks that I took out of James's band will go in our literacy bin like it it will not just be thrown away and even things I know we're done with I will either sell or donate Things like that like it's not again very little is going in the actual trash um, and if you have any questions about Young Living I will link that below too we have used four or five other brands of essential oils and I will say Young Living has had the most significant change in a very short amount of time like Literally, y'all, my entire family is thriving. I mean, even my husband, who was just like, I mean, yeah, that's fine for you and the kids. The other night was like, where are the oils? So any other questions about that, let me know. Um, and again, I'll post the links for the bins. And when there is a sale, follow me on social media and I will be sure to let you know. Um, and then stay tuned for all other things, organization and planning, because I got a lot coming up. All right. Talk to you later. Bye.